I'm Jeff Sears, uh, President and CEO, Founder and Developer of Titan. Uh, Nine Dynamics has been in the market now for three months and we launched at Finnovate uh, New York about three months ago and this is our second conference. Excited to be here in London. Uh, our company is uh, software for investment analysis, modern digital toolkit for the future, really, for modernizing a workforce, for efficiency, uh, and just dramatically increasing the value of every employee in the company. Uh, plus, on the flip side, you just make better investment decisions. So we're a statistics-based, data science-based, AI-based company with two amazing strategic partners. One is FactSet Research Systems out of San Francisco. Uh, the best quality data in the world, and Microsoft, our cloud infrastructure partner, uh, both of which are large supporters, and we're very, very happy to have them on board. Hot topics, definitely uh, transparency, uh, opening up, you know, accessibility to the average individual or for companies to new technology, uh, making sure that information is flowing freely between you know, organizations and individuals. Uh, but transparency is definitely the biggest thing that we've seen so far. Uh, we definitely agree with that and that's really the backbone of Titan is unlocking data that's been typically locked behind very expensive data terminals, uh, making that accessible and usable uh, by the average individual. So sophisticated enough for your professional that can afford uh, you know, an expensive data terminal and an Excel expert. Uh, we're bringing that to a, at a fraction of the cost, making it accessible so you don't have to learn how to code, you don't have to do, you know, learn Excel, uh, but be more effective than, you know, somebody even a year ago that, that wouldn't have access to Titan, but had access to the most sophisticated tools on the planet. And we, again, thanks to Microsoft, thanks to FactSet for actually sharing this, this vision with us. It's a democratization of analytics and bringing this type of data to the public and, and to the average individual for the first time. Great news for us, On uh, we launched three months ago, as I said before. Our strategic partner in FactSet has actually reworked our contract and our, as John mentioned earlier on stage, we were expecting to be uh, launching the European equities in 2020 or late this year. Uh, we fast-tracked that and we were almost live last night. We'll be live this week with London, Germany, all the European exchanges, so we're very excited about our, our coverage expansion happening way more rapid than we expected, and we're actually the first company or first uh, partner of FactSet that's actually able uh, to license their data and sell direct to the retail customer globally. So this is two huge milestones for us in, in expanding our coverage and being able to sell to anybody in the world, and also on, the, on our partner side on Microsoft, uh, a bunch of exciting things happening there from a, from a standpoint of marketing. Uh, so very exciting Q1, uh, customer success, everybody's very happy, very well received. And we've just added Richard, uh, Richard Funk on the development side, he's our fourth hire. Uh, so there's an individ four individuals on the team, he joined three weeks ago. Uh, so really ramping up the team here to four and, and very excited about uh, the first and second quarter. Uh, so yeah, the near-term trends, for sure, I mean, this is what we do, uh, large-scale data analytics. Definitely, I think what's underestimated is the power of some of these new visualization platforms, the power of cloud computing. Uh, the new technologies are going to unlock not a robo-advisor, but it's going to bridge the human and data worlds uh, like nobody's seen before. And this is our primary mission, this is our primary goal is turning data into information and bridging the human to information world and, and seamlessly improving uh, the whole financial services investment analysis process, making it faster, centralized, having new conversations, uh, and just really uh, uh, making every organization more efficient. So we think there's a ton of change coming. We're already seeing it. We're on the forefront of that in, in the cloud. And we're excited to see where, you know, not only the end of this year is, but the next five years, I think financial services and the entire industry will look nothing like it does today, given the set of powerful tools.